Hello. Hi, hi. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Hi, Joanna. Hi, Natalie. What happened yesterday, Natalie? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hi, Joanna. Uh -huh, Natalie, what happened? Se dio a la fuga. Estaba. No, estaba enferma. Ah, all right, all right. Lo escribí ayer, teacher. Sí, I know, I remember. Yo para que usted me pusiera así como yeah. teacher. All right, very good. <laughs> all right, very good. Hi, Carla. All right, hi, Cesar. Hi, Carlos. Miguel Hi, teacher. Hello, Carmen. Hello. Hansel. Hi, Hansel. All right, Irma. And we have Cesar. Aha, Hansel, ¿qué me le pasó ayer? What happened yesterday? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, hi Irma. All right. Yesterday, I am sick. I am, I am cold. My nose, con, my nose congestion. Ah, oh, yeah, you had a, a stuffy nose. All right, that's okay, Hansel. Are you feeling... Como are, dijo, a stuffy nose. Stuffy. That's okay. ¿Ya se siente mejor, Hansel? Sí, today sí. Ya me siento yes. mejor. Excellent. Today ya me siento better. Excellent, very good. Nice, Hansel, very good. All right, guys, so welcome to another class. We're going to begin. Um, this is... Number 28. So next week is our last week, all right? So I hope to see you all next week, all right? And you need to be working on the platform, guys, okay? So make sure that this weekend you work on your section seven. Yes? Yes. Okay. okay. Very good. All right, guys. So we're going to begin right now with the topic. Yesterday we were talking about what, Carlita? Tell me what we were talking about yesterday. Uh, there, there are and there is. There are and there is. Carlos, ¿qué más se acuerda de ayer? What else can you tell me about yesterday's topic? Your answer. Excuse me? Ay, señor. Uh -huh. Carlos, what else do you remember about yesterday's class? Uh, we we use um, the sure answer All right. for do and does and yes. Ah, okay, uh, yeah. Also, also during the week, very good. Thank you. Um, there is guys. Is a singular or is a plural? Singular. 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 And there are. Plural. 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 All right. So when I use there is, I um, use. Uh, the article a uh, or not? Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. And when I use there are? No. No, right? Okay. Do you remember, Irma, do you remember what is the plural of mouse? Mm. <laughs> no me acuerdo, teacher. remember. Carmen, what, no. is the, what is the plural of mouse? No lo veo en su cuaderno. Aquí lo quiero. Mice, very good. Mice. Mice. Ah, mice. No, mice no. Mice. Mice. Very good. Ah, yeah, pero no se pronuncia así. All right, very good. Next one. Eh, what is the plural of... Miguel Ticas, what is the plural of tooth? Teeth. 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 Very good. All right. Yes. What is the Rocio? What is the plural of foot? Feet. Rocio. <laughs> what happened? Está ronca. Hoy está ronca, Rocio. Yeah, Rocio. <laughs> All right. Aha, Rocio. What is the plural of foot? Rocio, what happened? <laughs> Oh. The plural of food. Feet. Feet, very good. Joanna, what is the plural of child? Esa no la pusimos ayer. Child. Children. Uh, I'm sorry, teacher. No estuve ayer. Estoy en la luna. Ah, oh, Joanna. <laughs> All right, very good. Sheila, what is the, the plural of child? Mm, I don't know. 
You don't know Shailita. <laughs> no. Miguel Ruano, what is the, the plural uh, child? Uh, children. <laughs> children. Very good. Children. All right. What is the plural of goose? Geese. All right. So, remember that, eh, eso lo, lo mencionábamos ayer porque Daniel nos preguntaba si siempre tenemos que ponerle el sustantivo lleva S cuando decimos there are lamps, there are bookcases, there are televisions. Yes. All right, hi Eduardo. Good evening, really? all right? But some of them tenemos los plurales irregulares que son mucho menos, pero existen. Por ejemplo, foot feet. Obviamente si dice fit ya no le ponga S, no dice, no, don't say fits. All right, porque no es pies, es, 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 es. All right, it's just feet, two feet, all right? Talking about that yesterday, guys, do you have any questions about yesterday's topic or you're okay? Okay. You're okay? Yeah? All right. So, I'm going to begin, guys, with, como hoy es jueves, no hay mucho, de clase, qué barbaridad. Bueno, tres que me dieron permiso. All right, so let's begin with this. This is the presentation that we're going to be working with tonight. Uh, oh, my goodness. Yep, all right. So, guys, look at this. Um, Eduardito, can you read this, please, Eduardo? Countable. Countable? Countable and uncountable. Nouns. Uh -huh. A and yeah. And there is, there are. Excellent, very good. And this is class number 28, and this is Harry Potter presentation, all right? <laughs> all right, whoa. Wow. Excellent, right? Did you whoa. like the effect? <laughs> I no tenía nada que ver la cueva de Harry Potter con las otras con los que estábamos viendo hace un rato. No. No, Hansel. <laughs> Donde puso el derir y el there are. Pensé que era de, 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 de describirlo, por lo menos. Esa cosa de Harry Potter. Decir, no. there is uh, uh, una punta en la torre. Ay, señor. No, ahí no. Ay, no, ya. All right. Pero ya pueden, va, vamos a, a describir el castillo Harry Potter un día. No se preocupe, oye. Pues ayuda. Bueno, está bien. All right, countable nouns. We have there are persons, animals, or things that we can count. Para saber cómo lo vamos a singularizar. We have they can be singular or plural. All right. And countable nouns. They are substances, concepts, etc. that we cannot divide into separate elements. We usually treat uncountable nouns as singular. Cuando yo le digo love, usted puede contar cuánto amor siente por alguien. No. Usted dice un amor, dos amor, tres amor, por amor. No, right? You say a lot of love. I love you very much. It's uncountable. Yeah, uncountable. Very good. What about traffic in San Salvador? What about traffic? Can you count traffic? No. No, you cannot count traffic. Can you count water? No. no, no, you can't count water. All right. So those are things that you cannot count. All right. Good evening. Good evening. All right. So now, no nos vamos a meter mucho en los countables y count, uncountables, right? Esas tres, cuatro palabritas that we have here. Porque la vamos a usar with there is and there are. So we say there is, there are, a, an, some, any. All right. The first one, Carmen, can you read it? A uh, and an or a and an. Use why countables with 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 with. Use with countables in singular. Example: There is a plum. There okay. is there is a plum. There is a plum. Plum, yeah. Ciruela. A plum. There is an apple. An apple. There is an apple, all right? So usually, cuando es algo contable, lo puedo pluralizar y lo puedo dejar singular. Si solo hay una, I say mm -hmm. there is 
an apple, all right? Because remember the a, uh, an ant means one. Okay. Yes? When there is a plum and there is an apple. Excellent, very good. Joanna, can you read number two? Some. Two. We countable and. Countable? Countable and uncountable in affirmative sentences. Example. There is some su su sugar. 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 There is some apple. There is some sugar. There are some apples. La palabra some we can use it for countable or uncountable in affirmative sentences. Ahorita yo tengo digamos 16 estudiantes. Let me see how many I have. Yeah, 16 students. So digo. There are some students, all right? Not everybody, but some students, all right? Uh, next one, I say, um, I want some coffee. I don't count the coffee, but I said some coffee. Can I some? I can use it with affirmative, countable, and uncountable sentences, all right? And then I have any. Uh, let me see who's going to read. All right. Oops, 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 oops. No, very safe. All right. Any? Um, Daniel Javino. Daniel, are you there? No? All right. Uh, Wilbert, can you read any, please? Any? Okay. Use with countables and uncountables in negative and inter interrogative sentences. Uh huh. Example There isn't any sugar. There are, there aren't any apples. 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 Is there any sugar? Are there any apples? Excellent. Very good, Wilbur. Very good. All right. So here, guys, what we're saying is we're using, a, you can use any for countable and uncountable, igual que el anterior, for both, in negative and Interrogative sentences. All right, not positive. Okay, we use some for positive sentences, but we use any for negative and for, and for questions for questions or interrogative sentences and negative. Hasta ahí vamos bien o ya nos confundimos en algo. Are we okay, guys? Oh, Esa es como su regla. So I want you to take a picture. Si puede imprimir, le póngalo ahí como poster in your room, all right? Okay. Okay. Next one. Vamos a ver. All right. Can you read that, guys? Todos ahí? No. An, an owl. owl. This is an owl. An that owl. little picture is an owl. All right. An owl. An owl. Okay. A table. 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 Right. Very good. What is that? An, an apple. An apple. An apple. An apple. Some apple. Some. Apple. Thank you. Some apple. Apples. Very good. Apples. Oh, what's that? A cat. A cat. A okay. A kitty cat. What's that? A wish. A, a man. A wizard. A man or a, a boy. A it's boy. boy. It's a boy. All right. Very good. So, tenemos el artículo an or a because it's only one. We have some because it's positive and it's countable. We say some girls, porque podemos contar a las chicas o a las niñas, right? Some girls. A boy, because it's only one. El A lo reemplazamos o quitamos el uno, no decimos one boy, decimos a boy. When you say a boy, it's only one, okay? Okay. Yes, let's continue. Some significaría algunos. That's right, yes. Okay. Algo Ajá. Uh -huh. Some water. Some water. Water. Some Como water. 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 Some Lo puedo usar para countables and then? Countables. Countables. So I say some water. Uncountable. What is that? A bread. A bread. A bread. A 
some bread. Some bread. Some bread. Porque no lo puedo contar. Porque es una unidad. No es como el pan francés de aquí, que usted dice, deme una cora y le dan cinco por la cora. Mm. Cuatro, bread. Eight. Ah, cuatro. Ah, perdón, así dan cinco. Ah, <risa> wait. Ok, so I lo, a bread. Oops, a bread. bread. Un conjunto. Le den como bread. un conjunto. All right. So some bread. No digo a bread. Ok. Um, Wilber, no, 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 Wilber, no. Sheila, read it, please, Sheilita. Countables now. We can use the identity, idem, indefinite, indefinite article. A, and we countable nouns in singular. We can use some affirmative and any negative intero interrogative. We countable nouns in plural. All right. So, quiere decir, lo que veíamos ayer, que cuando yo digo there is, I can use or an. Depende de qué. ¿De qué voy a usar? ¿Ya les, di, ya, ¿Ya les expliqué el uso del I y el an a ustedes como grupo? Sí. Yes. Ok, very good. Ok. Entonces, recuerde que es el sonido, ¿verdad? Del que la palabra que le sigue. Si es, suena como vocal, I'm going to use and. If it sounds like a consonant, I'm going to use a. Yes? Yeah. Right. And I'm talking about countable nouns because I can count it. Si yo digo there is a computer, que decir que there is only one computer. All right? Mm -hmm. So I use a for countable singular nouns. Porque when I talk about plurals, I cannot use a or an because it is pluralize all right okay then we say we can use some for affirmative countable and not and countable and uncountable and any for negative and interrogative with sounds in plural in plural all right very good okay very good next one all right uncountable nouns We can use some in affirmative, igual que los countable, and any in negative and interrogative with uncountable nouns. Oops. Yeah, there, sorry. Okay. Yes. Hey, the question. Um, Did you use the countable um, uncountable nouns in the other time? Um, simple past. Uh, sí, you can use whatever tense. Yo le digo, habían, habían ayer muchos estudiantes, pero bueno, some students, algunos. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Thank you, teacher. All right. Finish, guys? No. Yes. No. Okay. Yes, no, yes, no. Carlitos, did you did you get a haircut? Yes. Carlos, did you get a haircut? Do you understand haircut? No, I don't understand. Like your hair? Your hair. Oh, uh, uh, I'm sorry, yeah? I'm sorry. I can't hear you very well. ¿Quién yeah. me está manchando mi pizarra? I don't know. I don't either. Okay, so, Eduardo, continue. We use. We use there is with countable nouns in singular and uncountable nouns. All right. So, there is, we're going to use it, we're going to use it for both, for countable and uncountable nouns, all right? Yeah? Singular. In singular, everything's going to be singular. Mm -hmm. We use there are. Um, continue, Eduardo, please. We use there are with countable nouns in plural. All right. Como los no contables no se pueden contar, nunca van a ser pluralizados. Always in singular. Yeah? No ¿Cómo digo... así, teacher, como un ejemplo? Si no entiendes. A ver, como yo le digo, 
Hay tráfico en San Salvador. Yo le digo, there is traffic in San Salvador. There is, que es singular, y tráfico. A pesar que hay mucho tráfico, no le puedo decir, hay un tráfico, dos tráficos, tres tráficos. Puedo contar los carros. Siempre se le va a poner el son. ¿Cómo se va a decir tráfico? Ya voy, ya voy ahí, Hansel. All right. Entonces, luego, Sheila, no, como no lo puedo contar, los no contables, they are always going to be singular. Siempre va a usar there is. There is traffic, there is sugar, there is coffee, there is water, there is... Um, there is a gran trabazón en San Salvador. There is a big, a big traffic jam, big right? traffic jam. I know. <laughs> Mientras que los contables, las cosas que usted puede contar, que puede decir 5, 10, 20, 1 millón, 30, 50, las puedo no poner en, en plural, porque puedo decir hay 50 manzanas. There Pero are puedes... 50 apples. Pero también ¿Qué? podemos decir, there are some apples. Sí, there are some apples, cuando usted no quiere decir o no da ¿Cuántas? la información de cuántas exactamente. Okay. Y no se puede decir many. También. Sí, en qué caso se usaría? Porque en también es plural. Es in negative. Ah, oh, ok. Espera, mm. uy. Ahí right, está. Sheila. Any in negative and interrogative. Ah, oh, ok. All right. Para ambos. Contable, no countable. All right. Okay. There are, there are many, there are many rain. It's okay. No, there is many rain. There is, there there is. Actually, no many, porque many is para contable. There is ah, much rain. There is much. Much rain, rain. yeah. Many is for countable, much is for non-countable. All right. All right, let's see. Um, Irmita, read this, please. There is an O mm -hmm. on the table. Okay, very good. Sheila, desapareció. It's negative. ¿Cómo decimos ahora, Sheila? There isn't any O on the table. Ya, yeah, porque no hay. No hay ningún O. Okay. All right. Mientras que aquí decíamos... There is, there is, there is, decía, ¿verdad? Yeah, there, there is, is an owl. There is an owl on the table. Table, very good. Next one. Y owl no es propio, o nuestro. Owl es bull. Oh. All right, there, a ver, let's see. Um, eh, Joanna, read that, sen read the, the sentence, please. Mm. There isn't any wall in the table. There isn't any owl on the table. Aha, mm. Miguel Ruano. Hi. Can you read that, please? <laughs> read it. There is a cat under the table. There is a cat under the table. How many cats? One cat. One, one cat. cat. ¿Cómo sabemos que es one cat? Because But if we, there is we one cat. Porque es animal no importaría. No, because there is a... There is a... The article. Excellent. Because we're talking about the article on... And, and, and I'm the name. Consonant. The noun. And the noun is in singular. Yes, yeah. very good. There are many cats. Yeah. There are many. Como de there Harry Potter desaparecen a todos ahí. There isn't. There isn't any cat. There isn't any cat under, the table. Any cat under the table. Acuérdese que Lenny y Sheila va para el... Question. Any cat under the table. There is All right. some... There is some water. Ajá. Uh -huh. <coughs> on the floor. On the floor. On the floor. floor. There is any water on the floor. Mm -hmm. Any water on the floor. 
Hágame esa. Um, there are many. There are many books on the table. Uh, on the table. Pero no estamos usando many, estamos usando some, any, or a uh, or an. Oh, there are some. And books. There are some. Books on the table. Mm -hmm. oh, there are some books on the table. There are books on the table. There are many books on the table. There are many books on the table. There are books on the table. ¿Se diría bien, Eduardo? Podemos decir, there aren't books on the table. Sin agregarle any. Yeah, but it sounds better if you say any. There aren't any books on the table. It sounds much better, Eduardo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next one. When we talk about interrogative form, we switch it, all right? Yo digo, is there a cat? Is there any water? water? All right, next one. Yes, there is. No, there isn't. There are, are there any books? Acuérdense que Lenny lo ocupo para negative. Very good. Yes, there are. No, there are. Okay. Is yeah. there anywhere on the floor? Is there anywhere on the floor? Yes. Yes, there is. Is there anywhere on the floor? Yes, there is. No, there isn't. Let me observe. What is that? What is the question for that? <clears throat> Is there a cat, there is on, a cat. The ca on the table? Is there a cat on the is table? There on the Excellent. table is there a cat on the table? The answer is there. Yes, there is. There is there. Maybe on side. I have this one. Are there? Are there, are there, are there many? Are there some books on the table? No, acuérdate que el sum lo ocupo para positivo. Any, there are 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 any, are they? are any, there are are there are there are there many there any, there there are there are Excellent, very good. No, there aren't. There aren't. Okay, hágame un favor. Tómele foto a eso. Espérame, ¿sabe qué vamos a hacer? Espérese, espérese, espérese. ¿Y quién me manchó la pizarrita? Mm -hmm. Hansel. Hansel, usted me manchó la pizarrita. Hansel, Hansel. Yo no fui. Yo no fui. No, no Hansel, I'm not wearing. All right. Se le, se le ve los ojos a Hansel ahora. En serio, quiero ver a Hansel dónde está. Where are you, Hansel? Qué malos que son. Ve y que me sigue manchando, pues. There is Hansel. Oh, no, no. All right, okay, take a picture of this one. Oh, sí. Yeah, porque... Yeah. Excellent. Tú me dijeron, pírenme. Se quitó la cámara, Hansel, para que no lo moleste. No, Hansel, no lo molestamos. No se hizo falta ayer, Hansel. All right, next one. Muy bien, gracias. Okay. This is next. Quiero ver. Espéreme, no sé. Esa era la primera. Number one, I'm sorry. This is number two. Wait, please. Oye, ¿cuál tengo yo? Okay. Okay, next one. 
Permíteme, permíteme, permíteme. Oh, no. No te voy a dar share, please. ¿Qué es esto? Irma, ¿qué va a pasar, Irma? Me cuento un poco, Carla. No, eso ya lo tengo. ¿Qué es esto? Wait, relax. This is number one. Ok. Uh -huh. Is the last one. Is number two. Ok. Uh, This is number three. Okay. This is number four. Uh -uh. <laughs> okay. Back to the, to the no, number, number three, three please. Espérame, no. me voy a terminar aquí, luego la repaso. This is number, ya no me acuerdo. Number? Number <laughs> four. Five. This is number... Oh. Uh, la four. Oh, ya me perdí. Ya me perdí. <laughs> Esa es la última. Any cat? Espere, me voy a volver a ponerla, Dios mío, como ya juega. Oh my God. Okay. Me está regañando. La número tres, por favor. Espere, Eduardito. This is number one. one. Yes, thank you. Okay. This is number two. Okay. Okay. This is number three. Ah, oh, no, Eduardo era, ¿verdad? Okay. 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 This is number four. Okay. Hey. This is number five. Okay. Number six. Lo voy a mandar al grupo para que decidan cuál de todas esas opciones es la correcta. Se ha sacudido en la cama y Elisa que mañana va a dormir temprano. Yeah. Um, I will share the pictures. Okay, let me see. Can you see the picture? Yes. This is the this is the number one. Or no? Okay. Let me know if you need help, okay? Okay. Bueno. Y en la cuatro. And in number four, Carmencita. No, no, es que no, es que no pude tomar fotos y estaba anotando, teacher. Y me quedé. Any, any cat here. Any cat here. Any cat here. Yes. yes. Thank you. Number five, Carla. Uh, any water here? Any water? Yeah. Countable. No. Dice, uh, we use there are with countable nouns in plural. Mm. Mm. Affirmative. Mm. There is is the option. There is some students here. Say it again. Hello. Say it again. Your sentence, Shayla. There is uh, some students here. There is some students here. Because we can use the it it in because so uh, uh, and, uh, and singular. Uh -huh. mm. 
Pero si tenemos students, ¿qué sería? There is or there are? There are. Ah, there are. There are, there are any, there are some students here. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Uh, next. Next one. Uh, uh, your please. There, there aren't. No lo podemos pluralizar, entonces there, there are. There lo negamos. There are. There are. Porque el, el, el N es para las negativas y interrogativas. Any mm, es por eso. Mm, there, there aren't any water here. Pero acuérdese que si es water es no contable y si es no contable siempre va a ser singular. Yes, there is uh, singular. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay, okay. Okay. There isn't. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. There is. Vamos al otro. Vaya, aquí sí ve. There uh, are there any students here? Porque se puede contar. Or is is there? Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo le queda? Is, are there any students here? Are there any are there some are there any students here? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Up harder. Que está en pregunta. Yes. There isn't. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Any there is. Here. Anyone here? There. How are you? Tired. There isn't. Anywhere in here. Okay, and había más, no me recuerdo si había más. About students, but I cannot. You wanna see, see it? Any... Yes. We uh, need the, the last picture, but ah, okay. That's any that's student? Good. Any student here? Any student here? Okay, okay. It's, in this case, it's, a, it's, a, it's a question. Are there, yes, are there. Are there any students here? Because the noun is in plural. Yes, is, is, um, parecido, how do you say parecido? The same. It's the same, uh, the, the anterior. Mm -hmm. Did you finish? Um, yes, we yes. finished. Okay. Finish. Very rapid, teacher. Very rapid. Very mm fast. -hmm. Oh, very fast. I'm sorry. Okay, pero sabe qué? Le voy a compartir una última cosa para que continúen eh, working there. All right. Let me see here. Okay. All right. Can you take a picture of this one too? Oh, no, no, please. Wait okay. a moment, please. Mm -hmm. Ready. Esa, uh, picture is in uh, describir lo que hay también, como ayer. Yep. yep. Mm -hmm. okay. no, Pero ahora sería, usando, no, ahora no, usando no, some, no, any. Una, okay. una, una Barbie en la cama. Mm -hmm. O algo así, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Es decir, hay una paleta sobre la cama. Yeah, take a picture. Hansel, you just have to use there is, there are, any, a, uh, or some. De, depende de lo que va a decir o lo que haya en la foto. Ah, bueno. Finished? Yes. Okay, go back to your rooms. Termine de hacerlo de Harry Potter y luego hace esto, all right? Okay. Finish Harry Potter. Es que si era de Harry Potter. 
No, no se preocupe. Ok, comienzo yo. Yes. There are sounds, some pencils. What is pencils? Pencils. Pencils, yes, ok. There are sounds, the pencils. There are some pencils, pero ¿dónde? Um, ok. Que veo en el suelo, en la mesa, en la silla. Ah, pues, Quiero ver. There are some pencils everywhere. Excuse me? You can say there are some pencils everywhere. Everywhere es en cualquier lado, en todos lados. Ah, ok. There are some different pencils over. Over worry. Okay. Okay, Cesar. Um, there, there is um, bicycle, bicycle. There are some bicycles. Uh -huh. Quiero ver. Suelo, ¿cómo se dice? Pregunta. ¿Cómo sería? ¿Sobre el suelo o, o, o en el suelo? Oh. Um. It's, it's grown. It's grown. Grown. Okay. Um, there is a network. They want. Okay. Okay. Um, there, is, um, there is some lamp on the gab. Yes, it on the gab. Muy no entendí que me dijo. They, but they, they is some plum on the go. Ah, okay. Mm. There are some heaters, they shared in the back. The back, perdón. Repeat, please. No, no, no hay alfombra. No hay alfombra, I do not remember. No. Um, mm, well, more, ah, there is um, one. There is job. a lamp? There is a lamp, I don't remember seeing a lamp. There is a bicycle. A one bicycle. There is a a bicycle. A bicycle. A bicycle. A bicycle. A bicycle. Teacher, a bicycle. Yeah. Yes. Okay. There is a an adult on the. Le ponga el an. Si la la siguiente palabra empieza con sonido de consonante va a sonar como a. 
Yeah. Si la siguiente palabra tiene sonido de vocal, entonces le pone an. Coincide que siempre que es una vocal es an y que siempre que es una consonante es a. Por pero eso no es esa es la regla, es el sonido. There is a pillow on the bed. Excellent. Ah, muy bien. Thank Very you, nice sir. sentence. Yeah. Okay. There is a dos on the floor. There, ¿cuántas, cuántas muñecas hay? Two. I still not remember. And I no can, no, I can a picture, teacher. You cannot see the picture. Ah. No, no friends, hay dos muñecas. So memory, okay. Ah, sorry, two. No se ve. There you go, yeah. Uh -huh. Ajá, two. Oh, many, oh, many toys. Acuérdense There, que para, para si hay uh, varios, entonces usemos some. There is a... Ya no le ponga el A, porque es singular y some es un poco más de uno. Uno. There is some toys. Excellent. Very good, Carmen. Nice sentence. Nice. Very good job. For you. There is uh, some books on mm. the, ¿cómo se llama? Repisa, teacher. Shelf. On the shelf. Yep. Say it again, Carlita. What? Tell me again the sentence. Uh, there, there are uh, mm. some books on the, ¿cómo era? Repisa. Shelf. Um, shelf. On the shelf. Very good. Yes. Any books? On the shelves. No, there are some there, books, Mr. Carlita. There are some books. Ah, some books. There are some books on the shelf. 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 Yeah. Shelf. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, there are some there? books yes. on the shelves. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. My turn. Um, there aren't. There aren't. There aren't. No. There are. No. There, there aren't. Are. No. Es yeah. negativo, verdad? Yeah. Okay. The, si dice there aren't, sí, pero. Entonces. La sería, there are any cats here? There are any cats here? Así. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. There yes. are any cats here. Yes. Right. Next. Any. Vamos a ver. Next. 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 Any wire here. Mm. Este ejemplo que no lo puso ella. Which example? I am anywhere here. Mm -hmm. Estamos en eso, teacher. Teacher. Mm -hmm. eh, use any in the singular. O oh, uh, solo lo vamos a usar en plural. ¿Para eh, cuál, Daniel? Eh, la anterior que teníamos que era. Any cat any, here, any, teacher. ¿El qué? Uh, en la number four, any cat here. Uh -huh. Póngala, uh, la puede poner. Sí. How many cats? How? How many cats? Yeah. One cat, two cats, three cats. And no, pero es que Daniel lo que a... dice es el uso de any, um, ella, um, teacher. Any, y? Bye, bye. Yo lo que lo que comprendí de Eni es que lo podemos usar en contables y no contables. Por ejemplo, aquí dice, cat, aquí dice cat, me estoy refiriendo a un gato, entiendo. Entonces yo le decía a él que igual puede, se puede usar Eni en esta interrogativa. Eh, 
es correcto, pero lo que yo le preguntaba es que si se va a usar en, en singular, porque cat o cat para plural. En ese caso me tengo que guiar por el sustantivo, o sea, cat. ¿Es plural uh -huh. o es singular? Por eso eh, les preguntaba, singular. ¿cuántos gatos hay ahí? Solo wow. uno. Solo uno, ¿all right? Okay. Porque dice cat. Entonces okay. voy a decir, ¿is there o voy a decir, are there? There is. Ah, ok. Are, is there? Uh -huh. Is there any cat here? Excellent. Okay. Si cat tuviera S, fuera are there. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok, teacher. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Va. Is, is there any, any key? <laughs> oh, sorry. Is there any, any key, cat here? Quedaría, any, ¿verdad? Any cat here? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Is there? Vaya. Anywhere here? Um, por eso ya, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. um, vamos a ver anywhere here. Um, there, there is an. There are. Espérenme, espérenme. What number are you working on? Uh, no countable. No countable, ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. es... Entonces sería. Si no lo podemos contar, Sam. Yes, yeah. Daniel. Mm -hmm. Sam. Okay. Si um, ¿Sí yes o no. Sam. There is some. Pero ya están usando el N en el water están todavía. Mhm, uh -huh. water here. Mhm. Uh -huh. Es que verdad que usted solo dijo que identificáramos si estaban correctas o que no las volviéramos a escribir. No tiene que escribirlo acusando la opción, la, la opción correcta. Correcta. Uh -huh. okay. Ahí sería este son. Está incorrecta porque en yo sé son. ¿Por qué qué, Daniel? Porque usamos son en afirmativo. Pero esta no está en afirmativo. No puede estar en afirmativo porque igual any. Ajá, es que está en, en, en... Entonces cuando está así, eh, se identifica como negativo, ¿tú Cuando lleva sí. el any. Sí, exacto. Ah. Y si fuese pregunta, llevará un signo de... Ajá, eso. Ajá. Y no lleva, eh. ¿cierto? No, no lleva. Uh -huh. Entonces tiene que ser negativo. Si usted ve Lenny, es negativo. Ah, ok. Es, entonces sería there aren't any uh -huh. water. There aren't, no. very good. there aren't any water here. Sorry, okay. there isn't. No, 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 no. there isn't. Okay. Water. Uh, water is singular. Lo que pasa que como es no contable, there isn't. Los no contables se vuelven eh, siempre singulares. Ah, ok. Mm, ok, teacher. Va, entonces, there is an anywhere here. Uh -huh. Ok. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. There isn't. All right, everybody's finished? Yes. All right, let's see, guys. We're going to we're going to share this. All right, number 1. Number 1. There are some students here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are there some students here? Vamos a decir what there is. 
There is there, is there, there are, there aren't, are there. There, there are some there students are. here. Very good. Number two. And a student. There is an student. There is a whole sentence. There? E there is. ¿Por qué va a ser there isn't? No, there, 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 there aren't. There aren't. There aren't. There aren't any students here. Very good. Uh, and now we'll hear. There is there an owl. Is, um, there is owl. an owl. 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 There is. Is there? Is there any cat? Excellent. Very good. There isn't any water. There is. Oh my God. There isn't any water. You understand, Eduardo? No. Oh, wait, wait. What happened, Eduardo and Sheila? No, le hicimos así. Es que no le dimos a negativo. Si lleva el N es negativo. Sí, sí. Pero también decía que para interrogación. Sí, pero entonces tendría que tener punto. Es, es signo de interrogación y no lo lleva. Mm. Yes, it is. Ah, okay. I, I made the same. All right. I did this. I did the same. Is in any word. All right. Yes. It's, it's, oh, we are going. It should say there isn't any water here. There isn't any water here. O sea que sería no hay ninguna agua aquí. No hay agua. No hay agua. No es literal. Mm -hmm. No hay agua aquí. Ah, vaya, está bien. Mm -hmm. The next. Uh, the next. The next is. one. No. Is there any student uh, here? No. no. Are there? Are there, are there are any there students there? here? Very good. The question. Yeah. Are there any students here? Very good. And the last one, guys, we have this one. Ah, are there some Give me some dolls? examples. Okay. Are there some Are there some dolls in the room? Okay, very good. That's a question. Another one. Give me a couple of more examples, guys. There are there, there, are any in there there is a bicycle or there are a bicycle. There is there is, there is a bicycle. There is. Okay, very good. What okay. else? There are there are some. Shirt. Shirt. Uh, okay, very good. Yeah, yeah. what else? Okay. Is there any bag in the room? Yeah. Mm -hmm. what there about... is an address book next to the lamp. There is an address book. Wow, next to the lamp. Very good. There, are, the... chair. there are two chairs. Chairs. With S, yes, very good. And the yeah. last example? There is um Notebook. There is a picture, there is a notebook, all right, very good. Okay. Okay, guys. Some toys. Some toys, very good. All right. So, oh, it's important that you guys remember that a uh, and an uh, is for countable nouns, singular. Okay. Some is for both, for countable and uncountable. All right, for in affirmative. An affirmative sentence. Excellent. And any is for countable and uncountable negative. for negative and interrogative. Also, you have to remember that non countable nouns, they are always singular. Siempre va a ser there is, there is, there is, there is, or there isn't, there isn't, there isn't. There isn't, there isn't, there isn't. Or is there, is there? Uh-huh. I tengo que ir right now. Así es que, feliz noche. Mañana no hay clase, ¿verdad? No, 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 no hay clase. Mañana no hay clase. Mañana no hay clase. Yo ahorita hasta aquí, hasta qué nivel de inglés hay que llegar? We have to practice. En la plataforma. Seven hundred. Bueno, está bien. No hay que hacer ningún examen todavía, ¿verdad? No, next week. Next week. Bye, está bien. Hey guys, thank you very much. I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow, no class. I'll see you next time. week. Bye. 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 Bye.